Few have the heart and determination each and every Sunday, quite like Adrian Peterson. Bulldogs to the end zone! Touchdown! It's on the 2010! Touchdown! His never give up attitude has made him one of the greatest to ever play the game and a hero in the eyes of so many. But he doesn't just bring that mindset with him to the football field. He brings an endless passion off the field in giving back. Last week, Adrian poured out his entire heart for a young fan who is looking for a smile. Anthony has a bicuspid aortic valve. It, he had a heart catheter in April, and they tried to poke it, get the, the two valvular leaflets fused together, and they tried to poke it open so the three leaflets can work on their own, but it didn't work. So no matter what, down the line, he will have to have full open heart surgery to have that valve replaced. And hopefully it can be put off as long as it can because as he grows, the heart valve doesn't grow with him and he'll have to have it replaced again and again and again until he finally hits adulthood and can have a mechanical valve put in. It's difficult sometimes. He gets tired really easily. He, you know, isn't always very active, sometimes quite moody because he's tired. But for the most part, we just kind of work through it and let him do things at his own pace and um, praying that he doesn't have surgery for quite a while. Five-year-old Anthony Chartier and his family traveled from Michigan last weekend as part of his make-a-wish to meet his idol. And the game's top running back made sure this youngster had a meeting he will forever remember. Nice to meet you, man. Let me sign some stuff for you. Huh? I have a little boy named Anthony. That's a pretty cool name. My mom's not a Vikings fan, she's a Bears fan, so. Ah. <laughs> I appreciate yeah, the honesty. You had to wrap me out, didn't you? <laughs> <laughs> so, she's a perpetrator here today, huh? Hey, I'm wearing the purple. <laughs> buckle. Oh, she has to unbuckle. I, know. Awesome. I possibly could make it happen, man, I don't know. <laughs> What'd you think? Think it was good? Look hot? This little bar right here is weird, but <laughs> not too loose. A little air, you know? Yep. A little air inside would help. <laughs> Good job, man. Let's do Good a job. Good job. Here, you guys. Yeah. So you can tackle me? Huh? <laughs> so you can tackle me? See if you can tackle me. See if you can. Oh. <laughs> you can't be scared. Better, come on, you better tap. What you gonna do? How oh, you think gonna tap me? <laughs> yeah. To be in a position that I, that I am now, you know, to be blessed to be in this position and to have kids, you know, want to meet me with their make a wish is. I don't know, like, uh, words can't even explain, express, you know, how that feels, you know. Um, so I'm always all in, you know, to come out and, you know, talk to the kids, play around with them, because um, you never know what the kids are going through. Um, so it's a blessing for me to come out and, you know, make their day, make their wish something that they, you know, um, they've dreamed about or, you know, meeting their favorite player or favorite actress or whatever it is. It's all about the kids making it happen for them. Anthony's heart may need replacement, but he shares the same never give up attitude of his idol. And the Vikings all pro running back quickly made sure on Sunday to make good on a promise to his new friend. So what I'm gonna do is, guys willing, I score a couple, a couple touchdowns tomorrow, I'll, I'll get you a game ball to make sure we get it to you. Okay? That'd be awesome. Okay. That'd be cool. Got a deal? Okay. Can I get a group shot with everybody? Oh, that would be great. All right. With an autographed game ball from Adrian Peterson in hand, young Anthony got one final gift, a powerful parting message he will forever remember. That was a good catch. It was. Mm -hmm. Nice meeting you, man. God bless you, okay? All right? I always stay strong.
and keep your faith, okay? Whenever you're feeling bad, just pray to God, talk to him. He hears you, okay? okay. When no one else listens, he always listens, okay? So anything you're going through, you're feeling bad or, you know, you're tired or you're upset, pray to God to help you, to give you strength. And he will, I know, because he has helped me get to where I'm at now in my life. Okay? All right? Yeah. All right. Love you, little buddy.